I have with me today an extremely interesting young actor. She's someone who's played the first hijab-wearing character in a Marvel film, Spider-Man Far From Home. She's also done a bit of Bollywood with Kabir uh, Khan's 83, which is, of course, a biopic on Kapil Dev. She's also done Netflix, and she's the first Pakistani British actor to be in a Netflix series. A lot of work, a lot of work other than this as well. Aajkal aap inko dekh rahe hain, drama serial Dil-e Momin mein, and she's playing Faisal Qureshi's character, which is Momin. Uh, his sister, younger sister Annie, I have with me, Zohar Rahman, who I'm so happy to have caught a day before she returns to UK, where she lives, <laughs> and she's... Uh, sort of in, in transit right now. Zoha, assalamu alaikum, and thank you so much for taking time out. You have a flight in the afternoon, and this is just like, you know, it's, it's amazing that you took time out for this no, interview. No, of course, I would take time out for you any day. I did. <laughs> I was supposed to fly out you last did. night. You did. You did. This was, this was, this was any day. This was, a di- this was a tough day for you. You're traveling in the afternoon. Yes, but thank you so much for having me and for that lovely introduction. <laughs> for that lovely introduction that I was just trying to find the right words and not go into a cliche that, you know, the first hijab-wearing character yeah. in a Marvel film, but that's what it is. That, that's how I am introduced usually. That's yeah. the one thing that, I guess, sets me apart. Absolutely. But of course, it's because of the hijab that that character got noticed. Absolutely. Right? Absolutely. Otherwise, if it were just a Muslim character, mm. uh, we've seen a Muslim character in the Marvel Universe before, but yes. that character was a terrorist. Yeah. And um, yours is just a high school student. Yeah. Exactly. So that, that's amazing. You've also done Netflix. And you're, are, are you technically the first Pakistani British to be in um, a Netflix original? I don't think so. I don't think so. No. No. Maybe, maybe Pakistani. Yeah. Um, but I'm sure there's uh, British South Asians who've done Netflix. I'm so not, you, you've done one episode of the Young I've done an Young episode Wallander. of Young Wallander. Yeah. Um, and on Apple TV, I've also done an episode of Foundation. Right. And, and, and there's a lot more work to come up. And then there's Dile Momin. And there's 83. Yes. <laughs> you've done 83. It's just like everything. It's everywhere, which we haven't been able to watch, of course, because Indian films aren't playing in cinemas here. I haven't seen it yet. I'm in it. You're in <laughs> So I, I keep getting messages from people on my, on my Instagram tagging me like, oh, just saw you. Oh, just saw you. I'm like, okay, I haven't seen myself yet. But, so. but we did see you in the teaser, which is on, yes. on YouTube. So. I did not expect that. Yeah. I woke up one morning and um, I had... A, thousand messages because I was in the teaser and I did not not expect it (laughs) yeah sorry my hair is I did not expect it um the first message was from my mother-in-law who absolutely loves Bollywood Mm. and also hopefully loves me Um, (laughs) and she was like have you seen this you're in this I was like whoa what um and I opened and I watched it and I was like I'm in this wow I didn't expect to be you know in the teaser because although yes I have um a good character it's not big enough Right. For me. To be in the teaser. To be put in the teaser. Yeah. But the same thing happened with Spider-Man. Yeah. I, you know, I knew that I was throughout the movie, Mm. but I didn't expect to be in the trailer. Yeah. And the trailer is where I started getting noticed the first few times. Right. Because people were like, oh, there's a hijabi, there's a hijabi, there's a hijabi. Yeah. Um, So again, it was the same thing with the the trailer I was in it as well. Amazing. And you think that they they put it on a hijabi and maybe it would be typecasted and... But it hasn't been that way. No, um, which is you know, which is why I'm so happy and so proud of that character. Yeah. Because usually you see anyone who's visually Muslim, whether it's you know a man with a beard and a pagri, yeah, um, or it's a woman in a hijab, it's usually well for women, it's usually someone who's you know um, oppressed or absolutely someone who's. It's not really an empowering character for any Muslim. To yeah, see. yeah. And this was a chance to portray Muslims in a very normal. Light. Light, absolutely. She's just a student. She's absolutely. just on a school trip. Yeah. She's just having fun. There's no, you know, there's nothing about her being Muslim that's a conflict mm. in this. She's just there. And yet she's so stylish and she's uh, part of the cr- gang. Absolutely. You know, she's part of the gang. There's so much I want to ask you about Spider-Man. But then you also did 83. Yes. And you were playing your, an Indian character, I'm assuming, yes, because I'm there's a Bindiya in the teaser. Yes. So, yeah. I'm a first-generation immigrant. You're a first-generation immigrant. Yeah. So, 1983, yeah. And you work with uh, Ranveer Singh. And there's Deepika Padukone. Now you're going to tell me that, <laughs> no, we didn't do any scenes together. Uh, so, I <laughs> didn't get to see Deepika because we didn't have any scenes together. Right. But I did see... Um, uh, Ranveer and also um, Irani and obviously I work with Kabir a lot yeah. so I saw him like all the time all the time every day <laughs> every day yeah yeah but it's amazing how living in London you can connect to all these different projects which wouldn't have been possible were you in Pakistan no no, no. but then you came to Pakistan yes 
and um, and you did the Limoman. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's there's the Marvel universe, and then there's Bollywood, and that's a biopic, and then there's the Limoman, and then there's of course a lot of work in between. But and you you studied law. Yes. So the, your trajectory is like all over the place. Yeah. Right? I don't know if that's a good thing. <laughs> it's a good thing. It's a good thing because I think you're being noticed. And it's so important for young women like you to get noticed, who have their thoughts straight. Yes. Uh, taking us back a little bit, uh, we will try to talk Urdu mein baat kare because okay. like you said before the interview, you are Pakistani I and you do, you do speak Urdu. Dil se Pakistani. Dil se Pakistani, yeah. yeah. And I want you to also share that incident, that dil se kitna Pakistani ghar banate mein. Because that's interesting. But, um, so, first tell me how you got the role. For Spider-Man? Zoha. Yeah, Zoha. Spider-Man, um, बाहर जो है आपको रोल्स ऑडिशन से मिलते हैं राइट right. होता क्या है कि जब आपकी प्रोडक्शन हो रही होती है प्रोडक्शन डिसाइड करती है कि हमें ये 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 कैरेक्टर्स चाहिए hmm. और फिर वो वो उन कैरेक्टर्स को ढूंढते हैं एक्टर्स राइट बेसिकली और वो एजेंसीज के पास जाते हैं कि हमें ये ब्रीफ है ये बंदा चाहिए ये बंदी hmm. चाहिए hmm. अगर आप आपकी एजेंसी में आप इनको रिप्रजेंट करते हैं तो आ, हमें बताएं hmm. तो एजेंसीज जो हैं वो प्रोफाइल्स भेज देते हैं तो मेरी एजेंसी ने प्रोफाइल भेजी hmm. जो जॉन वॉट्स जो डायरेक्ट कर रहे थे स्पाइडरमैन राइट एक सेकंड सॉरी थोड़ा सा पीछे जाऊंगी आप एजेंसी के साथ यू वर साइंड अप बिकॉज यू वर ऑलरेडी मॉडलिंग फॉर कमर्शियल जी ये मेरी मॉडलिंग एजेंसी थी राइट right. मैंने एक्टिंग एजेंसी अभी तक नहीं ली थी राइट right. बट वहाँ पर मॉडलिंग एजेंसीज वो एक्टिंग भी आपको दे कैन पुट यू फॉरवर्ड फॉर एक्टिंग राइट तो उनके थ्रू उन्होंने मेरी प्रोफाइल भेजी मार्वल को मार्वल स्लैश सोनी एंड एट दैट टाइम यू डिट नो योर प्रोफाइल वाज गोइंग टू मार्वल नो 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 उस वक्त आपको कुछ नहीं पता होता अलोंग विद आई एम श्योर लाइक अ थाउजेंड अदर प्रोफाइल्स क्योंकि काफ़ी सारी एजेंसीज हैं और ये वर्ल्ड वाइड ऑडिशन थे और उनको मेरी प्रोफाइल पसंद आ गई एंड आई वॉज शॉर्ट लिस्टेड फॉर एन ऑडिशन तो उन्होंने फिर मुझे पहले एन भेजा <laughs> तब मुझे पता जब एनडीए भेजने तो आपको पता होता है कि कुछ बड़ी चीज़ बड़ी चीज़ है।, है कुछ बड़ी चीज़ है hmm. um, उसके बाद मुझे ऑडिशन के लिए इनवाइट किया गया एंड आई वेंट इन फॉर दी ऑडिशन वे वॉज इट इन लंदन इन लंदन एंड उस वक्त आई वॉज इन श्योर कि किसके लिए है hmm. मुझे पता था कि काफ़ी बड़ी चीज़ है hmm. तो एन साइन करने के बाद बैठे हुए उन्होंने मुझे स्क्रिप्ट दी एंड uh, कहा कि बस आप जब रेडियो बता दें तो मैंने जब स्क्रिप्ट पढ़ी उसमें लिखा उसमें एक लाइन थी विच वॉज Uh, what Spider-Man doing in London? Huh. <laughs> and I was like, oh, okay. Mm-hmm. This is not the time to get nervous. Yeah. Just breathe and go with it. Go with it. Because I mean, I'm sure you know that in Pakistan, Spider-Man is a huge thing. Huge. We have seen it from childhood. I think of all the superheroes, Spider-Man we have seen the most. Absolutely. Spider-Man and Batman. Yeah. It's always, you know. Yeah. Tobey Maguire, ki, Andrew Garfield, we have seen it all. Yeah. So it was a huge thing. But at that time, I sort of फोगाट कि किस चीज़ का है मैंने अपने आप को भुला दिया ना वो एक लाइन्स पे फोकस करो और बस ऑडिशन दो मैंने बस ऑडिशन दिया और मैं निकली और मेरे लिए था कि इवन ऑडिशन करना वॉज अ बिग ऑनर फॉर मी यार मुझे मार्बल ने ऑडिशन के लिए बुलाया या मैं बहुत खुश थी निकली मैंने कहा चलो मिलेगा नहीं मिलेगा देख लेते हैं प्रॉब्लम नहीं मिलेगा दो दिन के बाद मुझे फ़ोन आ गया प्रोड्यूसर से कि यार वी रियली लाइक यू और एक दो सवाल हैं एंड देन वी आर गुड टू गो आपके एजेंट से बात हो रही है ओके वट सो इट वॉज स्टिल वॉज इन कन्फर्म्स आई वॉज वेरी कंट्रोलिंग माई साल कुछ नहीं है किसी को नहीं बता रही थी कुछ नहीं हो 